hey guys welcome back to my channel i am getting ready to install some faux wood over here in like my little vanity area which is all over here this is the carpet my vanity looks like kind of raggedy right now i'm in the process of revamping it so like i need to get some new lights and i don't know what else i'm gonna do some new lights probably i don't know if i'm gonna keep those shelves or get some different shelves but Oh, and there's my little skin fridge. I haven't put that on YouTube yet. But yeah, this is all going to look brand new probably in a few weeks. But right now, I'm just going to focus on this floor because I recently moved back home. I'm in my dad's house. And he asked if I could put something underneath my vanity because the carpet in my old apartment, like my college apartment, was just not cute. Like, I dropped a lot of makeup on it. Um, I burned a hole in it. With a flat iron like that carpet was just really really raggedy so i'm gonna protect his brand new carpet over here with actually no i'm gonna vacuum first and then i'm gonna show you guys the wood paneling and then me putting it in so let's go I got these a while ago and they've just been in this box. I got these when I at first burnt that hole in the carpet at my old place. And I just never got around to actually putting them up. So, I'm going to come in handy now. I got... They came in um, sets of three. So, I ended up getting nine of these. Oh, these are actually in packaging. They are called the Forest Floor Slated Wood Grain Printed Foam Mat. So it has the texture of like a play mat pretty much. But um, yeah, I'm hoping that these are going to hold up and look decent enough. <laughs> okay, so... I'm gonna start with the ones that were already out of the packaging. And they're supposed to be like interlocking, so I shouldn't have to use any glue or anything, but I'm thinking about maybe going back to use some glue if I feel like they're gonna come apart, but we're gonna see. And I think I said already, I got nine of them. Yikes, I thought I was gonna be able to fit like three right here, but this is only two, so I probably got too many. This space is so small, like I'm so grateful to be able to move back in here. But honestly, moving to a room that is like a third of the size of my old room, of my old room at my old place with all of my stuff has been like playing the hardest level of Tetris. Like I have so much stuff that I'm so attached to and I don't have place to put everything. Like I've been here for, I think maybe two months. And I literally still have stuff in boxes. Like, is really anything? Yeah, I got too many. I don't think I'm gonna be able to fit six. I'm gonna try. And I like that the little um these border pieces, like they're removable and not, so I can create my own borders. That's pretty cool. I wish that it looked like a little more seamless than like, oh, oh, I think I'm, maybe if I put the wood all going in the same direction, it would look more seamless. Let's try that. Cause like the wood grain is like, one way and I had it kind of weird so I'm gonna switch them around see if that works oh yeah I'm gonna link these down below I got them off Amazon I think I paid I don't remember maybe like 40 I don't know I feel like at the time when I got them in my head I'm like oh this is nice and it's like cheaper than a decent area rug so I went with it I'm just 
I look great. This is, this looks like a freaking daycare. Fill these things in with glue. It would look. <sighs> Maybe just that's not a good panel. Let's try this one. I'm thinking maybe I should put like the little carpet pad things, whatever, underneath to keep this from like sliding around. <sighs> well, yeah, I definitely have too many because this last one is like gonna end up kind of going underneath my bed. Which is fine, but like, that was not my original plan. Oh, this is the bad one. So maybe this one's the bad one. I don't know. I hate how, like, some of it, it looks seamless, and then on the other areas, it's just, like visible than this, this little puzzle piece material. <laughs> Why would you poke your head in here? You really scared me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoops. It's okay. What do you think? Oh, my ring light's in the way. this this works I feel like I can probably do some pretty good like workouts on this like ooh. it's not like a yoga mat or anything but this is kind of weird it's not like a yoga mat but this isn't bad it's, it's firm but it's not like super hard so I could probably just put my little mat on top of this and that would probably work Alright, so this is easy. If you're interested in it, it's going to be linked down below on my, um, in my description box. This is probably something that'll be really great if you're, like, renting, you don't want anything permanent, or if you're, like, traveling with a setup or something and you want the floor to look decent. Do you like my floor? Do you like it? Bless you. Bless you. Do you like it? Maybe a little. Where are you go? No, come come back. Do you like my floor? Do you guys like my floor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like it. It looks nice. Oh, that's great. It's teenager. Oh, you guys aren't even teenagers. It's tween approved. I think my dog's okay with it. Shall I look at commercial? Don't pee on my floor. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's cool then. Alright, get out. Come on, baby. baby.